Hi, I'm Old Sneelock. Welcome to another episode of Old Sneelock's Workshop. When the tools you used as a young man turn out to be antiques when you bought them new, it kind of says something. They're classics. They're tools that do the job quickly, efficiently, and they hold up. Now this old thing has cut roots, dug out rocks, shoveled dirt. I've used it a lot. Dad was an electrician and I was cheap labor. If we needed to bury a wire 100 yards out to an old barn, yeah, that was me. So I'm going to clean this mugger up and get her back ready for another 50 years of use. See where we go from there. First thing I got to do is fix the handle. It's loose. Putting screws in a handle to hold it just doesn't work. I know dad did it, but it just doesn't work. Instead, I'm going to use the screws to try and pull the wedge out. Oh, there's one part. That pick does it. Let's see. One last piece. Well, it's coming, but it doesn't like it. This is a die bar. We use these to separate sections in the dies. And this one was something that we made there in the shop. It's just a chunk of square tool steel that we heated up, flattened out, and then hardened. Well, I had more power with that pry bar, but <sighs> kind of overcame the grip of the vise. That's a unique wedge. I've never seen one like that. It's it's a wedge and it splits the handle and forces it out in all four directions. 
I don't know if I necessarily like it though. Because the handle came loose. It says Brazil, two pounds. So evidently this mattock was made in Brazil. From the mold lines, it looks like it is a cast steel piece. I know it's cast steel because cast iron would never hold up with this kind of a blade. And that ring kind of gives it away too. It was painted red, so we might just paint it. Make it look like it did when it was new. There was a wooden plug in the center of this wedge. I don't know if I'm going to be able to pull that out, but we're going to give it a try. That's a piece of it. Okay, that's cleaned up. Now I gotta trim down this so that I can get that head to sit properly.
Well, this was a quick repair, more of a spring cleanup than an actual restoration. But the old Matic is going to be good for a long, long time. If you have any suggestions for a new video, questions about today's video, or any of the other videos on the channel, just drop a note in the comments. You know I read them all. Thanks for watching. This video is not to be viewed by anyone under the age of 13 in the U.S. or 16 in the European Union without the express written permission of the parents or legal guardians of the underage person. Such written permission must be on file at the local government entity in charge of enforcing the rules and regulations established by the FTC. Anyone violating these terms is admitting by default that they hold harmless the owners and operators of this channel. Any and all questions should be addressed to your local branch of the FTC.